Hi there again, Miles here at East Horton. Uh, this week's uh, little video for you is probably the most important one I've done so far, I think, really, because this is the one that's probably potentially saved most of you the most shots. Uh, so it's just about alignment. I know that sounds very basic, but the last thing I read about Tiger Woods was what you're working on, and he said alignment. And I guess if you're hitting your five iron 200 yards, then you best hit it straight, I guess. So it's a really simple system. It's, it's really the only way of aligning yourself. Um, so I'm just going to quickly talk you through it. It's a nice simple railroad track system. So I've got these tubes down and like with all your shots, your very first job is always to align the blade. So that's quite a good thing to remember. That's job number one, align the blade. So you're going to point that blade down your intended target line. Okay, and now uh, equally importantly, feet, knees, hips and shoulders all on a parallel line to that. So there are your two tracks, club and ball on one path to the hole, and then really your body on the parallel line to that. Okay, so let's just kind of go through a couple of things that people get, seem to get wrong a little bit. Okay, so you're nicely aimed up, you're ready to go, you have a look at the target, and you plonk back down again, and now you've got your shoulders in this big open position. So that's, that's gonna to start to encourage that slice spin going across the ball, the spin that's gonna drive it to the right, potentially a glancing blow, and possibly if you're turning the blade a little bit, a pull. So that's number one little tip for you. Once you've set up into position, just tilt your head. I can come back to your target again. It, that way you won't make that little mistake. Okay, let's get back to the probably much more common way of misaligning is I've got a big slice. So I'm gonna compensate for that slice by aiming miles left. Now, if I get this right, I get this big drift out. We hit it to the left and it comes back down into the middle. Well, you've got two big problems with that is you, one, you're going to miss out on loads of distance because half the ball's flight sideways. But again, like I just said before, you're encouraging even more slice spin. I mean, if you were just trying to cure a slice with just purely alignment, then you'd stand closed and try and put some draw spin on the ball. And I don't really want you to do either of those things because it's just wrongs making rights. Okay, let's just go through it again on how you should aim. So you'll notice all the tour players come from behind the ball and all they're trying to do is pick out a point between their ball and say lay maybe a metre in front, a little coloured different bit of grass, a daisy, the edge of a divot. Much easier to just to line yourself all up with maybe a metre in front than such a long way away. So just that's your first little stage. And then just try and make sure you've got all these other parallel lines. So feet, knees, hips and shoulders all on the same line as this second track. All right, so bits go away in practice, I guess. And a couple of things for you. If, you. if you're very good on the range and not very good on the course, almost undoubtedly it's an alignment issue. Nicely gridded up on the, straight, on, the, on, the, on the range map. But when you come out into the big sea of green and there's not much to grid yourself up to, then you've got to keep drawing these um, mental lines to target and for your ball. Okay, second one, really common mistake, is people aim their body at the target and the club. Now you've set up for a hook and you're in your, in your own way potentially. So they are hooks and pushes from that sort of setup. So a bit to think about again this week, I guess, but back into fundamentals again. And like I think I said to you before, go through your little checklist, aim, grip, ball position, stance and body alignment, and then posture. And then just try and find that nice little balance point just before setting the club away from the ball. So best of luck this week. Let's hope this fantastic weather continues. And uh, I'm just gonna say to my little camera woman, Daddy daycare today. So um gonna say goodbye, Polly. Bye bye. Bye. Right, see you all next week and uh good luck.